Hi everyone, so we're here in Cab Shell again and we are going to be doing some drone mapping at the cliffs. We're hiking down uh, right now and I have with me uh, João, who's the, the master student uh, that's uh, joining us for this project. So João, maybe you can tell us a little bit like how you joined the project and what you're going to be doing. Sure, of course. So um, I watch most Earth videos like most of you and uh, I really enjoy their work and as a master student I was looking for a master thesis um, about ecological restoration. So I talked to Mossy Earth and they could use some help uh, in this project. So yeah, I'm here integrating this, this project and we're going to fly the drone today, <laughs> uh, try to map some, uh, some, some of the cliffs uh, to look out for some specific plants. Um, and yeah, that's what they're going to do. <laughs> So, João, what are you doing right now? So, right now I'm flying a drone. Um, I'm scanning the cliffs, I'm mapping the cliffs. Um, we tried uh, to, um, to fly autonomously, but the, um, the cliff is very rough, it's, it's not very even, it's very uneven, so we have to fly manually. Um, so, we are at the same distance of the cliff, the cliff every time, or at least we are trying to to be at the same distance every time um, so that we, the, the pictures will be at the same resolution and we can successfully identify the species. So yeah, that's a very boring job. I think it's very exciting. Look at that. <laughs> nice. Hope the result's worth it. <laughs> We are uh, walking to the cliffs here in Cab Shell again. Um, we've been coming here the past uh, few weeks and uh, yesterday we actually managed to get some really nice images of some of the most inaccessible uh, parts of the cliff. And it was just great to see like uh, the euphorbias because of the rain, they're really green and bright. So even flying from, uh, from not that close to the cliff, we really got a better understanding already of, of where they are. Uh, which is great and today we are planning to fly another mission um, with a bit higher resolution so we can also have a better chance of detecting some of the the other species we are interested in so that's what we're going to be doing today it actually looks like uh, perfect conditions for mapping or almost perfect yeah it's kind of cloudy yeah Life is very homogeneous yeah, I think uh, with the with the cloud, uh, it makes just makes the light very diffuse, which which means we don't have these shadows, which which will make the the, the which will make it harder to find the plants, and also it's not that windy, so it seems like we uh, we might have a good day of, of mapping ahead of us. So, what do you have to say about the conditions now? I think the weather the weather don't want us here. I think it's not meant to be today that we will fully map the, the cliffs. The rain is not on our side. Uh, so what was the plan for today? So for today we thought that we could fly the drone uh, and map uh, some of the, um, the cliff autonomously. Just like uh, we put the grid on the, the app and the, the, the drone will fly alone and um, yeah, it did not happen because, uh, because of the weather. Uh, it started raining and the wind was very strong. And, yeah, we, um, we took the day for uh, searching around the cliffs. We found some new places with the euphorbia and convolvulus, the, the plants that we are looking for. Uh, we also found, found the, the caterpillar, super nice, you'll see the, the shots. Um, and uh, yeah, it was a good day. We, we spotted um, the plants uh, on the other side. We, we flew. Oh, wow. <laughs> flew. We flew the drone uh, in some other places when the wind was uh, was slower, calmer. Uh, we flew the drone in other places, and we found uh, new nucleus or new spots with uh, the plants, and it was super nice. The the highlight of the day for you. Right now, this is the highlight of the day. We are now watching the waves uh, because it's a big swell today, and we are watching the waves against the cliffs. And it's a yeah, it's a, a nice uh, show to watch.
so we're back here at the cliffs another day uh, we've been having some issues with uh, with the software trying to get like a way to to map this area here automatically um, issues with connection uh, just getting getting to grips with the with the software and Joan is now uh, preparing a mission and we're quite confident that this time it's going to work uh, it's a bit windy but uh, still all right for the drone and there's also rain uh, forecast so we're, we're just a little bit nervous hoping that uh, now we'll fly a successful mission um, and hopefully we'll have some some really nice data uh, that we can start analyzing about this this cliff section here So what are we looking at? So right now we are checking out uh, in the computer what is the progress of the flight, of the automated flight that we planned. Uh, we are checking that the, the drone is probably one third uh, of the mission completed. And you can see them, you can see the drone flying there. And it's a, a very interactive software. It's, it's, everything is going as planned, so today was a good day. So after a few days of uh, struggling with the software and with connection and trying different things, we finally managed. So today we managed to have the, the mission fly automatically. We scanned the whole sort of cliff section behind us uh, and we got some extra close-up shots of the areas that seem to have uh, to be particularly interesting for plants. And I think this will be enough to create a really good uh, map of the cliffs. Um, and even just looking at the photos, like now we have a folder where we can just see every section of cliff in a lot of detail, which is amazing and, and uh, I think will be really useful. Uh, João, I don't know if you have anything to add about the feeling at the end of the day? Finally we made it. <laughs> After many struggles we made it to, to, complete, to completely scan and map the, the cliffs and that's a very satisfying um, feeling. Nice. It will be nice to see the, the models that come out of it. Let's try to make them. Yeah. Alrighty.